I'm going to talk about uh, an event that we did on the 11th of uh, November, Friday, at the Qadi Ayad University uh, here in Marrakesh. Um, it's an event we do regularly at the COPS. We did it last year in Paris, we did it the year before that in Lima, we've done it at the SP meetings in Bonn, and we've also done them at the Asia-Pacific Regional Adaptation Forums uh, a few weeks ago in Colombo and the year before that in Malaysia. So for the last few years, uh, we do, it's a, a networking event on loss and damage, uh, which is an emerging topic. Uh, I've spoken about it in a separate video log, so I won't go into the details of what loss and damage entails. But as an emerging topic, what is happening is that more and more groups, particularly researchers from universities, but also NGOs and others, are beginning to engage with the issue. They want to know what does it mean, what is happening, how can they engage, are there useful things for them to do. And we do this networking event essentially for newcomers who want to know more about the topic, want to know how to engage with the topic. And in particular, one of the things we try to facilitate, and when I say we, I'm talking about the International Center for Climate Change and Development and my colleagues there. We've been doing this for some time now, as I said. What we try to facilitate is to link researchers who are looking at this as a brand new topic with the process in the UN Framework Convention on Climate Change, which is quite complicated with the Warsaw International Mechanism, the Executive Committee of the Mechanism, the um, Paris Agreement Article 8 on loss and damage. The details of the negotiation text and agreements are quite complicated and not that easy for the uninitiated to engage with and understand how that works. So we work as a gatekeeper, as a facilitator, as a connector uh, to those who are new to the topic but want to engage with the topic and enable them to be more effective. First of all, to know what the issue is, how to connect with it, and if they wish to engage, to be, do so um, more effectively. And we've been doing this for some time now and we hope to continue to do it as well. There will be a report coming out of the workshop uh, which anybody can download from our website which is www.iccad.net.